Hello everyone, this is Drew Bradshaw, and today we're looking at compound predicates with direct objects. A declarative sentence is a statement that ends with a period. Compound predicates are two or more verbs or simple predicates in one sentence joined by a conjunction, and they have a direct object sometimes. They are diagrammed after the vertical line separating each from the verb and the direct objects. The direct object is the noun receiving the action of the simple predicate. The conjunction could be for, and, nor, but, or, yet, so, and they join the compound predicates and they're diagrammed on that vertical dotted line. Let's take a look at this sentence. It says, Tinkerbell loves Peter Pan, but dislikes Wendy. Who or what is this about? It is about Tinkerbell. What does Tinkerbell do? She loves. What else does she do? She dislikes. So we have two simple predicates. Who does she love? Peter Pan. Who does she dislike? Wendy. The word but connects two things. It connects loves Peter Pan and dislikes Wendy. So when we diagram, we have our simple subject. We separate our subject from our predicate. Simple predicate one, simple predicate two, direct object one, direct object two, and the word but goes in between on the dotted line. Let's take a look at these sentences. The sentences are correct, but the diagram is incorrect. We bought sleeping bags, but borrowed tents. Who or what is this about? It's about we. What did we do? We bought. What did we buy? Bags. What kind of bags? Sleeping bags. What else did we do? We borrowed. What did we borrow? Tents. The word but connects two phrases. What does it connect? Bought sleeping bags, borrowed tents. Let's go ahead and diagram this correctly. We bought bags. What kind of bags? Sleeping. Borrowed. Tents. My baby sister plays peekaboo and catches soft basketballs. Who or what is this about? It's about sister. What does she do? She plays. What else does she do? She catches. What does she play? Peekaboo. What does she catch? Basketballs. What kind of basketballs? Soft ones. What kind of sister? Baby. Which sister? My. The word and connects two phrases. Plays peekaboo, catches soft basketballs. So we need to diagram this correctly. And it looks like they've diagrammed everything correctly, except they need to have vertical lines to separate the simple predicate from the direct object. They should not have the lines that point backwards. So now I have corrected this diagram. Did you eat Santa's cookies and drink his milk? This is a question. We need to restate it as a comment in order to diagram it correctly. So we need to redo it as you did eat Santa's cookies and drink his milk. Okay, now it is a statement. 
we need to figure out who or what is it about. It's about you. What did you do? You did eat. And what else did you do? Did drink. What did you eat? Cookies. What did you drink? Milk. Which milk? His milk. Which cookies? Santa's cookies. And connects. Eat Santa's cookies. Drink his milk. Okay, this is diagrammed incorrectly, so let's diagram it correctly. You did did eat cookies which cookies santas you did drink drink what milk which milk his and Sometimes the compound simple predicates share one direct object. Let's look at this sentence. The boys will wash and wax the car. Who or what is this about? Boys. What do they do? Will wash. What else do they do? Will wax. Okay. What will they wash? Car. What will they wax? Car. So they share the direct object. Which car? The. Which boys? The. And connects two things. It connects wash and wax. So we have our simple subject. We have our simple predicate one. We have our simple predicate two. Notice that the word will goes for both of these words. Here is our direct object. We have a modifier. We have a modifier. And the word and connects these two simple predicates. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks of this diagram. My horse likes her saddle but hates her bridle. Who or what is this about? Horse. What does the horse do? Likes. Likes what? Saddle. Does the horse do anything else? Yes, the horse hates. Hates what? Bridle. Which bridle? Her bridle. Which saddle? Her saddle. Which horse? My horse. But connects two phrases. It connects likes her saddle, hates her bridle. So we have horse likes saddle which saddle her saddle but hates bridle her my horse chip and dale steal nuts and tease donald duck chip and dale steal nuts and tease donald duck who or what is this about chip Dale, and connects those two. What do they do? They steal, they tease. What do they steal? Nuts. Who do they tease? Donald Duck. And connects steal nuts, tease Donald Duck. Chip, Dale, and Steal, nuts, tease, Donald, duck, and. Chef Michelle chopped and diced veggies, or the veggies. Chef Michelle chopped and diced the veggies. Who or what is this about? Chef Michelle. What did she do? She chopped, she diced. What did she chop? Vegetables. What did she dice? Vegetables. And connects chopped and diced. 
the modifies vegetables. Chef Michelle chopped and diced veggies the Sal will prune and water the vegetables before our garden party. Who or what is this about? It's about Sal. What will he do? Will prune, will water, and connects prune water. What will he prune and water? Flowers. Which flowers? The flowers. Before our garden party, is a prepositional phrase. Prepositional phrases always start with a preposition, end with an object of the preposition, include every word in between, and answer either time or space. Before our garden party, that is a time. What will, it, what will happen at that time? Pruning, watering, sal, will prune water and the flowers before our garden party. For these next few, you need to come up with original sentences that fit these diagrams. Again, this space here and here could be the word the if you want it to. Make sure to look at the other um, questions and sentences on this worksheet so you can easily create your own sentences. Make sure to do these two as well. On the last page, we have four sentences that need to be diagrammed. Mary lost her little lamb, but found him at school. Red Riding Hood carried a basket of goodies and fought the big bad wolf. Belle reads and collects antique books. Snow White quickly swept and mopped the dusty floor. I will diagram 4B for you. It says, Red Riding Hood carried a basket of goodies and fought the big bad wolf. Who or what is this about? Red Riding Hood. What did she do? She carried. What did she carry? Basket. What else did she do? She fought. What did she fight? Wolf. How many baskets? Uh, what kind of basket? The one that is of goodies. Which wolf? Bad wolf. Which wolf? Big wolf. How many wolf? The wolf. And connects two things. It connects carried basket of goodies and fought the big bad wolf. So now we need to diagram this. Red Riding Hood and carried, carried what? Basket, what, how many, uh, what kind of goodies and fought fought what wolf the big bad the big bad 